Welcome to WebHavi Web Scraping Workshop. In this video, we will see how WebHavi can be used to scrape various odds value from odds portal website. So we will uh, try to scrape the historical data of Premier League previous season. And for each match, we will try to scrape the closing odds for any bookmaker and also the over, under and Asian handicap values. So the first step which you need to do is go to settings, go to advanced minor options and change the data selection accuracy to low. OK and apply changes and then start configuration. And so we will have to use some codes for this uh, process and you can find all the codes used uh, in the link in the video description. And you don't need to use all these codes, only use them as required. So the first is to apply the first one which is required for all cases. So just copy the code to remove all the headers. Otherwise only the first match will be scraped. Click on anywhere on the page. Click on the run script option. Paste the code. Now before that, we need to scroll this page so that all the matches are loaded. The page will load all data only when the user scrolls down. So we need to automate this. So click on the heading, capture more content so that it gets this heading too. So both these headers are included here. And let's go for one second, more options, scroll list. Now that we are here, we can click on the next link, either next or two. Let's click on the next link and set as the next page link and then click anywhere run script and apply this code now we can start selecting data from this page so this is the home team every team and you can get these uh, odds values from here Instead of clicking on the button, click highlight the entire cell and then capture text. All right, so now let's uh, follow each of these match links using the follow this link option. And when the match details page is loaded, you can get the final result. Also the date of the match. And let's now see how we can select odds values for any of the bookmakers. So let's let's try to get the book of uh, the one X and two values for bit 365. So we need to use these regular expression strings for one home draw and away closing odds for bit 365. If you need to get similar values for a different bookmaker, for example, Pinnacle, just change the Bet365 portion with Pinnacle or your bookmaker of choice. So let's copy the first one. Go to WebHavi. Just make sure that you highlight the entire table. Apply regular expression. Just copy the regex which we just paste the regex which we copied, and you can see 1.29 is one. So bet 365 and similarly you can get ten point zero. See ten point zero. Now let's uh, open either over, under, or Asian handicap. Now the steps are the same for both these. So if you want to open any of these links, just click on this tab and apply the click option. So this will open up uh, the Asian handicap page. Now there are various sections and we need to expand the one which you are interested in. So suppose you would like to expand the minus 0.25 section. We need to use a code for that 
and you will find the code here code to expand Asian handicap minus 2.0 you can easily modify the code to open another section for example if you want to open say plus 1.25 we just need to change this value to plus 1.25 now for now we will expand the minus 0 0.25 section click anywhere on the page a run script paste the code and apply and you can see that the minus uh, 0.25 section has been expanded now select the entire table like this highlight this entire portion apply regex and we'll paste this we'll change uh, the bookmaker to pinnacle and this will actually get the handicap value for pinnacle so pinnacle handicap and for one and two we can use this So 1.26, 1.26, so this is Pinnacle Asian Handicap 1. Similarly, you can get uh, the value for 2 by using this, but by changing Bet365 to Pinnacle. So we can also get the page URL of this page by using Add Custom Data URL. And now let's stop. I think we have uh, made all the required selections in the stop configuration and start mining. In case uh, you're facing any issue with data selection, I mean, if there is any missing data in any of the columns while mining, you can try by reducing the number of parallel mining threads to one and start mining.